Welcome once again to Commander by Danan. Today's video is a bit special. I wanted to make a symbol deck, one that my kids could play, but still be competitive enough to win the occasional game. I also wanted to keep it ultra budget, and I think I succeeded, but time will be the judge. But before we get started, I'd like to quickly ask you to like and subscribe. It really does help the channel, and it's free. With that out of the way, let's get into the video. Yargle and Multani is a 6-mana, 18-6 legendary frog spirit elemental with no key words. That's right, this is a vanilla legend, but the stats are absurd. The flavor text is also hilarious. So to keep this deck simple, I wanted to focus around smashing our opponents in the face with Yargle and Multani. We've got ramp, card advantage, and ways to sneak past our opponent's blockers. We also want a few ways to protect our commander. Now, I wanted the deck to be under $50, but Yargo and Multani is currently pre-ordering for $10. I don't see it staying there though, so my guess is that by summer the deck will be under $50. Only time will tell. But before we get to our deck list, we should keep in mind our checklist. 50 mana sources, usually split between 37 lands and 13 pieces of ramp, 10 pieces of card advantage, 8 to 10 pieces of spot removal, 2 to 3 board wipes, 2 pieces of graveyard hate, 1 sudden I win card. Command Tower, Exotic Orchard, Temple of Malady, Dark Moss Bridge, Golgari Guildgate, Golgari Rot Farm, Witherbloom Campus, Jungle Hollow, Foul Orchard, Bajuka Bog, Myriad Landscape, Evolving Wilds, Terramorphic Expanse, Rogue's Passage, 13 Forests, and 11 Swamps. Soul Ring, Arcane Signet, Lanoir Elves, Elvish Mystic, Elves of Deep Shadow, Rampant Growth, Cultivate, Kodama's Reach, Migration Path, Mindstone, Solemn Simulacrum, Felwarstone, Dark Ritual, and Ranger's Path make up our mana ramp. Eternal Witness, Campfire, Harmonize, Sign in Blood, Read the Bones, Knight's Whisper, Explore, Colossal Majesty, Garrick Primal Hunter, Hunter's Insight, Siphon Mind, Ambition's Cost, Stinging Study, Damnable Pact, and Soul's Majesty help us dig through our deck and find answers in ramp. Beast Within, Putrefy, Reclamation Sage, Golgari Charm, Nature's Claim, Terra Sunder, Casualties of War, Kenrith's Transformation, Naturalize, Death Sprout, Feed the Swarm, Hero's Downfall, Broken Bond, and Binding of the Old Gods make up our spot removal package. Culling Ritual, Mutilate, Languish, Ritual of Soot, Deadly Tempest, and Tornado Elemental help to clear the board of any annoying blockers. Swiftfoot Boots, Kaya's Ghost Form, Demonic Gifts, Ashnod's Intervention, Feign Death, Supernatural Stamina, Fake Your Own Death, and Undying Malice all help to keep Yargle and Multani on the battlefield. Rancor, Muraganda Petroglyphs, Ruxa, Patient Professor, 
indomitable might and predatory focus help us to close out games faster and ensure our commander deals more damage. Now that we have our deck list, we should compare it to our tech list. 52 mana sources split between 38 lands and 14 pieces of ramp. A little heavy, but our commander has 6 mana, so that's fine. 15 pieces of card advantage. 14 pieces of interaction. 6 board wipes. 2 pieces of graveyard hate. No sudden I win cards, but Ruxa and Rogue's Passage both ensure Yargle and Matani are damaging our opponents. This deck is very simple. We want to turn our commander sideways and smash our opponent's faces in. We've got lots of ways to protect our commander. We could have gone with a pure Voltron list. Going from 18 power to 21 is very easy. But I wanted to keep the deck ultra budget. If your budget's higher, consider adding some tutors, swords, and maybe some totem armors to ensure you smash your opponent quicker. That being said, at only $50, this deck is a lot of fun and you've got a commander with some of the best flavor text in Magic. Now, some of you may be wondering why we're running so many board wipes along so many mana dorks, and the answer is simple. The mana dorks in our deck are simply to get our commander out as quickly as possible. After that, they serve no purpose other than chump blockers. Additionally, most of our board wipes don't touch Yargle and Multani, so does it really matter how many elves died in the making of this video? Are you building a Yargle and Multani deck? Or do you have a Voltron deck? Who's your commander? Leave a comment below. Thanks for tuning in. Once again, a huge shout out to my editor Cute Stuff. I couldn't make these videos without her. If you'd like to hire her to edit your own videos, there's a link to her Fiverr page below. If you're looking for ways to support the channel directly, you can head on over to patreon.com slash One of the tiers is specifically set up for commander. For only $25, I will build you a custom commander deck based around your specifications and even do a deck video on it. I also wanted to give a quick shout out to all of my patrons, Waffles, Jiraiya, Muffins, Marcus, Phoenix of Ice, Squishy, Brett, Roxy, Brian, Josh, Sean, Zach, Oton, and Richard. You guys are awesome. I post new commander deck videos often, so be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified of new videos. Also, if you're a fan of anime and manga like I am, feel free to check out my other channel, Musings by Danon. Again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all again next time on Commander by Danon.